All right, hello, welcome back. This is part two. If you haven't seen part one, link in description in the comments somewhere. Hope you enjoy. Put in I put in this intro because I split up the video. You already know. Yeah. Bye. No more chafing. <laughs> ah, no more chafing. You can hold this one, Patrick. Oh, I'm getting no. Yo ho ho, young lad! This sure what is your the lucky hell? day. I knew it, but why? Avasti, before he stands a notorious pirate captain, Pinza Rosa. I need some saps. I mean, a crew who can haul. I mean, share me treasure. I mean. Wait, no, yeah, I meant treasure that time. Oh boy, treasure! Right! Well, you seem deserving and present. Now, to share me treasure, you'll first have to get it out of an old shipwreck. Anyhow, I would get the treasure myself, but <laughs> I'm far too rich to do a crewman's work. Lucky day indeed, Patrick. With that treasure, we can prove we're real pirates. Technically, you won't be, though. I can't be bothered with the bureaucracy of registering a new crew. Or paying for them. She's pretty. Treat me like white teeth. Don't get me dirty. Pardon me, miss. Why so glum? Uh, because I like totally lost my joy. And without it, I can't sing. Which is like totally not cool for mermaids and stuff. Maybe it's in your fridge! Whenever I need joy, I can always find it in my fridge. Diabetes. SpongeBob, let's make some music! Then maybe we could go on a dance date? You helped me, even though this was, like, totally not your problem. To show my gratitude, I will grant you, like, a wish or whatever. I wish that SpongeBob and I could reach the treasure on the grounded ship so we could become, like, you know, like, like, totally date-worthy pirates. Like, have a safe flight, my melodic friends. Can we go on a date now? Uh, maybe later. Shiver me timbers! You're alive? I mean, welcome back! You truly earned your pirate names! From now on, you shall call yourselves... I don't know, whatever you can think of. Hey, you never said there'd be thinking involved! I have a mermaid to impress, so you better make good on your promise! Come about with that volume, me air-headed lad, before you alert the lagoon guard! They're a ruthless bunch who'll stop at nothing to get their fins on me treasure. These dusty old cannons still pack a punch, no? Oh, pack a punch. SpongeBob, thank Neptune. How did you get here? Eh, the usual. Magical bubbles, reckless wishing, tearing apart the very fabric of space and time. I won't bore you with the details. Oh, good. These restraints are so tight, I can't feel my leg anymore. Uh, I think your leg will be okay, as long as you stay yeah. away from termites. My leg! yet well we do have a real treasure chest the Dutchman sock treasure if 
finest pirate I ever knew went by Jeff. So you can be the there. one, I don't know. Square one. That's not fair. I wanted to be square one. Well, there. you can be square two. Sure, whatever. Oh, Battle Shark. How I missed you. Forward to All right, him. you're part of his crew now. It'll be grueling, mind-numbing, and repetitive. Just like cleaning a litter box. <laughs> square one. Use the wind bongos and flying boats to get yourselves onto me ship. Once on board, hoist me last sock and fire the huge cannon. That should signal me old crew to join us and revel in the destruction of Ahem. the downfall of dismissal? The dismissal of Admiral Prawn! <laughs> We're taking back this ship, Prawn. And my pineapple. What's the matter, Rectangle Boy? Pining for something special? <laughs> I will make you walk the plank. The only thing I will be walking is the road of friendship. And that road leads right to Victory Town. So bring it on. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a shrimp by the toe and crush him. Ahem. Fine, no crushing. Aw, home sweet pineapple. Let's get you back to Bikini Bottom, huh? Next stop, 124 mm -hmm. Conch Street. Oi, bro. If you weren't grilling those patties like an amateur has never cooked before, I wouldn't have to use my chum. Just follow my lead. If I was following your lead, me precious patties would taste like your disgusting chum. Mr. Krabs, what are you doing here? Are you working with Plankton? I had no choice. The poor citizens of Bikini Bottom were starving. I couldn't let him eat the garbage Plankton was serving. I'm right here. So we struck a deal. To feed those poor, hungry mouths. So long as they pay, of course. Well, if you don't hurry with those patties, crabs, nobody will be fed. Then you'll have to say goodbye to your sweet money. SpongeBob, you gotta help us. You're the only one I trust with me secret formula. Could you fix us some more Krabby Patties? I'm on it, Mr. Krabs. Thanks, mm. boyo. I know how you like playing dress-up, so I've got a little reward for helping out your favorite employer. I couldn't help but overhear you miss your little pet snail, Walter. Gary. Right, Gary. Well, with this cosmic costume, you should be able to enter the portal he was sucked into. But watch out, honey. That snail of yours is in big, big trouble. Down. Whoop. That's gonna be the end for this video. But that's gonna be the end. Hope you enjoyed. It's been a month. Hopefully this video has people seeing it. YouTube may not like me posting since it's been a month. But you know, hope you enjoyed. You already know if you do. Like, subscribe. See you whenever I do. Goodbye.